Hello and uh, welcome to the Highlands of Scotland. I have been invited to join the South of Scotland Golden Eagle project at a fairly secret location. We are near a golden eagle nest and there are some climbers that are down the cliff that I'm sitting at the top of um, and they are there collecting a golden eagle chick to help supplement the population of golden eagles in the south of Scotland that aren't doing so well by bringing in new animals um, that will grow to maturity and, and, and build this population to something much, much stronger and, and a thriving population. Um, and so I'm here really to document and to show you guys what the project is all about and what goes into translocating golden eagles. Golden eagles once covered the whole of Scotland as well as much of England and Ireland but are now largely restricted to the highlands and islands of Scotland. In recent decades the number of goldies in the Scottish highlands has begun to gradually increase. In contrast however the south of Scotland has too few eagles still remaining for a successful breeding population. And this is where the south of Scotland golden eagle project comes in. By relocating eagles from the larger highlands population it's expected that the southern population will begin to breed and hopefully thrive. So, during the cold, wet, early Scottish spring, a team of golden eagle monitors have been identifying nests with twins, only wanting to source eagles from territories with plenty of offspring. It is one of these nests that we have hiked out to today. First of all, John, the man responsible for the eagles during the translocation, fills a carry basket full of moss bedding, while the climbers prepare for their descent into the nest. Golden eagles build their nest or eyries on steep, inaccessible cliffs, and this is the biggest challenge in collecting a chick. While the climbers do their thing, the rest of the team must just wait. Eventually, the suspense is broken as we see Lewis return with precious cargo secured to his rope. This is where the veterinary team take over. The vets do a thorough check, examining eyes, listening to hearts and lungs, checking joint mobility, as well as taking blood samples for further investigation and forensic samples to pass on to the police. As soon as Gabby and Neil have finished their examination, Gabby carefully takes the young eagle to the carry basket, removing the hood put on to keep it calm. Once secure, John begins the steady trek back to the waiting vehicles. Once the team has made it back to the road, the young golden eagle is carefully secured in the vehicle before driving to the release site where the eagle will spend the next few weeks. So that's the eagle all collected, it's in the vehicle, the team are now taking it down to the south of Scotland where it's going to go into an enclosure ready for what we call a soft release. In the next video I'm going to explain what a soft release is, we can talk about and hopefully show the eagles being fed, everything that goes into looking after these golden eagles. So please like this video and subscribe. If you want a notification for when I post the next video, hit the notifications button, but I will see you in the next video.